the end times are supposedly rapidly approaching, thousands of conspiracy theorists have claimed online for months. Doom mongers and Christian fundamentalists are certain that a mystical planet X, also known as Nibiru, will approach Earth today on September 23. The wild conspiracy theory purports that the colossal planet ten times the size of Earth orbits the Sun every 3,600 years. David Mead, a self proclaimed Christian numerologist and book author, has claimed that Nibiru's approach will shift the Earth's poles, spark volcano eruptions, earthquakes, and monstrous tsunamis. If Planet X does approach Earth today, then the best way to look out for Nibiru is by watching NASA's live stream from the International Space Station IS.The live stream above is a direct feed from the IS, which constantly orbits the planet some 240 miles above the surface of Earth. The IS is the single largest man-made satellite currently in orbit and offers a breathtaking glimpse into the wonders of space. It takes the space station approximately 90 minutes to orbit Earth, completing almost 15 trips every 24 hours. During this time, the feed regularly cuts out into darkness for 45 minutes, as the station passes into the nighttime. Ajitiplanet X conspiracy theorists believe that Nibiru is heading for Earth over it is very unlikely that Planet X will show up in the live stream, because it does not exist. The existence of Nibiru has been consistently debunked by the American Space Agency, branding it an elaborate online hoax. Various people are predicting that world will end September 23, when another planet collides with Earth. NASA Various people are predicting that world will end September 23, when another planet collides with Earth, NASA said in a statement. The planet in question, Nibiru, doesn't exist. So there will be no collision. Nibiru and other stories about wayward planets are an internet hoax. There is no factual basis for these claims. Friday, September 22, 2017, the Nibiru hoax previously flared up in 2012 and 2003, with believers convinced that the Rouge planet would smash into Earth. If Nibiru or Planet X were real and headed for an encounter with the Earth in 2012. Astronomers would have been tracking it for at least the past decade, and it would be visible by now to the naked eye, NASA explained. Obviously, it does not exist. Eris is real, but it is a dwarf planet similar to Pluto that will remain in the outer solar system. The closest it can come to Earth is about 4 billion miles.